Hello, everybody. My name is Angel Hester, and welcome back to Banished. All right. I christened the Fisher Hut 2. Oh, that's actually cool. They look like they're a part of the same structure. I like. Okay, we need to focus on p food production. Okay, stop gathering. Stop gathering. Okay, I need to build a lumber. Okay, that's inefficient. That's inefficient. This seems like the most efficient place to put it. But just saying that though. Hmm. Okay, build you. And then a hunter. And then we're gonna need a barn. Okay, here's the forester. Yes. Good, 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 good. All right, we need more builders. How's the... Oh, right. Finish the tool maker. I notice our uh, amount of stored tools is kind of lacking. Well, shite. Great. We're out of tools. I don't suppose we can go to the local hardware store. Oh, right. We have to make everything ourselves. Alright, stop placing materials here. states of this game is kind of weird. It's like they skip a tile because another uh, citizen or another builder is going to build it. It's like, okay. Look how efficient my people are. That's very good. yet. Are there any traitors? I said trade, not traitors. I don't want to get stabbed in the back. This is, uh, slow construction. Just harvest stone. Whoa! We're gonna need to start stockpiling all the stone. One beef that I have with the game, though, is that there's no, like, collect food. Like, if you ever notice, like right here, mushrooms. I don't know what that is, but I'm sure it's edible. I mean, you just think. Why can't we have it? Ooh, I'm gonna need a herbalist. Um. All right, that's under construction. Herb. There we go. Okay, and I know I want to go for the achievements in this, but this particular achievement I don't want, which is the uneducated population. Because citizens that produce more, or are more educated, produce more. In theory. I don't know, in the real world it doesn't seem to work that way. 
I don't know how or why. I just know. <gasps> traitor, traitor, traitor. Yes, yes, yes. Over here, over here. Yay. What do you got? Walnuts. Uh, how much can all this firewood? How much can all this firewood be? Fudge. Ooh, um, we're gonna need all this. Every visit. This mess. See you next time. We need more lumber. Or we need more timber wood. Alright. Increment up to. Whoa, no. 600. Whoops. Alright, how are we doing down here? Alright, resume construction. Looks like our main issue is stone, so yay. What are we low of now? Firewood. Yay. We have plenty. Shut up. Okay, halt all, uh... Consuming operations. Focus over here. We need wood. Well, they need wood. I got plenty of wood. We need more food as well. Yes. Hunting. Begin hunt. Begin the hunt. Herbalist. Storage barn. Well, this just needs wood. Same with that. Okay. I guess we know what we're chopping. Deforestation. How are we on tools? You need wood. Well, shoit. There. Whoops. You need stone. All right, resume construction of the houses. We're doing piss poor in the food market though. All right, that's done. We don't really need a herbalist yet. But after we build the schoolhouse, I think all construction projects need to be put on hold until we get a good base uh, of resources. Or if we can get a trader that comes in with lumber, stone, and iron, and maybe coal. Coal is nice. I don't know, how do you guys like the format where I just play and try to interject funny things? Or should I just start cutting down the video so it's just me? What are you doing? Hey. Hey! You better pay for that. That's another thing. I want there to be an economy. I'm a finance major. I like games where there's an economy. Like you trade this for that and you get money. I like games like that. Mainly because I'm good about getting the money. Not that... Look away from the deforestation. Um, that's even worse. Moving on! It's actually ironic. In Space Engineers... Well... Not anymore, considering I have a concrete mod. But it's actually ironic. In Space Engineers Vanilla, I have too much uh, stone. Outside of Space Engineers, I need a lot of stone. Give me you.
Okay, we got four people, which is good. Well, actually, we got seven people that are available to do anything. Finish that house. Oh, I guess I could assign them over here. I suppose. Okay, maxed out in gathering and hunting. Now we need foresters. And we're out of population. Dang it! Oh, we need a herbalist. Alright, ladies, start popping them out. We need more people. Ladies? La ladies? Or not. How are you doing? Not producing, I see. You've made five logs, what the F? We need firewood, damn it. Alright, we need to deforest and uh, denature this area. But that's the nice thing about this game, too, is that if people don't have anything to do, they finish mundane tasks like chopping down a tree. Ah, good, good, good. We got plenty of venison, we got everything else. Good. I suppose we should make a clothing, uh, a tailor. That's what they're called. We could go for a town hall. This is where I would stay. And command, I mean, lead my people. What are we out of now? Logs. Logs. Shut up. I am very well aware of the situation. Can we get a new trader? Dang it. One student day. I suppose I could build wooden houses. But this provides more warmth. Because it takes like, I think I read, or it wasn't an article that I read. Um, I watched a documentary that said that like for clay and stone, the reason when you build a house out of clay or stone, it takes like an hour per inch for the temperature difference to uh, pass through. So like heating a home in, uh, or cooling a home in the desert, it takes like a, like, yeah, you get the pit, you get the point. I'm trying to remember that stupid article or documentary that I watched, whatever it was. <sighs> oh, I told you to do all this down here. Well, uh, let's just cancel all that. And just chop all that down. Of course, there is all this.
We can't really sacrifice these, though. We'll put the herbalist on, uh, ice for now. How long until you... Age 39... Oh, you're a teacher. I was about to say, wait, how old? You're... Wait, you're... You're a student? Good for you, but... Why'd you wait so long? Traitor, 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 nope. But this is gonna be a farming outpost or little area. Oh, look at all the materials. But it takes them so long to move. And I have so few people. I have a lot of children, but I condone child labor. Of course, you guys could help, you know. I'm pretty sure it wouldn't kill you. Maybe? <gasps> yes, yes. Yes, a traitor, traitor, traitor. Come on, come on. <gasps> Go away. Might as well start building more homes. But at the same time, just look at how much this thing costs. Okay, in the main city, which is basically where we're at right now, stone. The further out we get, wood. However, since we're still part of the main city right now... Ugh, just saying that though... I need nomads. I need a city hall. Or a town hall. This looks like a good place. All right, we're going to put that on hold. There we go. Okay, we need materials for my home. Start chopping. I need a home, damn it. We don't need three traders. Okay, we have plenty of tools. Yes, I know you don't know what to do with your life. Now shut up. Probably shouldn't have built the stone walkways. I've damned my people to suffer for my home. That's the worst thing I could have done.
Okay, we're traveling farther and farther to get these materials. This is not... Not efficient. Okay, we're gonna focus on stone up here. Fetch! Come on, boy! Fetch. We need lots of stone. Alright, we're gonna put that on hold and just start gathering the materials. Okay, so, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Get back to work, Susie. I see ya. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye.